So in this video, <coughs> I wanted to show you uh, this, the street that I'm driving on is um, it's two lanes on each side and it's divided, but it has a lot of uh, exits on it. And when I first started driving on it with autopilot, it would try to take every one of these left exits. Um, let me, uh, I'm gonna turn on this camera too so you can see a little better. There we go. Okay, yeah, so all these, all these left exits, um, it would, the auto steer would pull because it didn't know, you know, which line it was supposed to follow, especially if there wasn't a car in front. Um, so I'm going to activate pretty soon here. But what I've noticed is that as I drive this street more often, and it's been about, uh, I've had the car almost a month now, um, basically it's learned a little bit. It doesn't take these exits as much as it used to. Um, so I'm going to activate cruise control here. Here we're now on autopilot. So I'm going north right now. I'm going to turn around. Actually, this is a good spot here. I'll turn around here. Show you what it looks like coming the other way. steer on, 55 miles per hour, and it didn't take that exit at all. One thing, if you're if you're coming up to a light, and it's going to see this car, but it brakes kind of hard. You know, a normal person would be kind of slowing down and waiting for the light to turn green a lot faster than autopilot does. So I'm hoping that they uh, introduce, you know, light software or light recognizing software so that... Um, you know, it doesn't wait as long to start decelerating. Anyway, um, I did just pass an exit. It pulled just a tiny bit. Here's one coming up on the left as well. Um, so we'll see what it does. Yeah, just a tiny bit of nudge towards that. Um, but hardly anything. It corrected itself, basically. I mean, before, I mean, it, the first time it went through this road, I mean, it would almost lurch. I had to grab the steering wheel. And it was kind of like every one I had to sort of be ready and eventually I could keep auto steer on and I would just sort of hold the steering wheel where it was supposed to go. Sometimes it would deactivate because it really wanted to get off and sometimes it wouldn't. Um, but now it's just, um, you know, I, I'm still ready to take over but here comes another one. But I'm not, you know, like there, just a little bit, a little bit of like, oh, do I take, no, I don't take it. So, I'm not sure that's the exact voice that Autopilot thinks in, but it's probably close. Coming up to another light. Decent braking. Now when I say it brakes hard, it's not like, uh, it doesn't engage your seatbelt lock or anything like that. It's just, um, if you've ever driven with somebody that brakes kind of late, <laughs> and you, you find that your foot's like automatically pushing down on the brake, it's a little bit of that. So, but I'm not, I'm not doing anything pedal-wise here. There's gonna be another exit after this light on the left. Um, and all these exits, these are like turnarounds. Um, oh, and it started to steer a little towards it and then recognized it didn't wanna take it. It really, really helps to have a car in front of you. Um, Following a car seems to take precedence for at least as much um, significance as the lanes that it detects. Uh, so um, if you're following a car and the, and the car takes an exit, you definitely need to be able to you know, resume control. So anyway, um, it's pretty cool. There's, there's not that many Teslas here with uh, autopilot. So I would like to think that my vehicle's been doing most of the autopilot training um, or, you know, auto improvement um, stuff because I drive on this road quite often um, and like to use autopilot. So, yeah, it's really cool to help train it and um, see it learn. Oh, 
there. That was a pretty big lurch. That wasn't me at all. So it lurched over and then it corrected itself. Um, so apparently it doesn't know that one very well. But in its defense, I'm usually not passing that one. Uh, usually I would have turned off um, on a side street by then. Here's another one. Let's see what it does. Up oh, a little, little bit, but decided not to take it. No thanks, I choose life. So yeah, there we go. Thanks for watching.